me and you have been working together for a very long time. I mean, since the first time we met up a long time ago at a film workshop. Yeah, we kind of gravitated to each other kind of immediately. You can sort of tell you get the feel of the room and you can tell who who you can work with and who you can't. You jumped in, you wanted to write, I wanted to direct, and now six years later, yeah. we're still working together. Yeah, which uh, is kind of awesome. I really have I've always enjoyed working with this crew and these people, and we brought a lot of the original people that have been working on with us for years. We brought on some uh, personal mentors of Andrew. And uh, I think that you guys are really gonna like the, the product that we have to show you. And I, I really hope that the fun that we had making it really comes through in the final product. Hi, I'm Dylan. I'm the writer and one of the actors on The Last Heist, uh, which we're trying to get done here. First day of filming for the Road Reel Challenge. And we are Starting to make some headway, getting all, everything lit up. We got our other actor coming in uh, directly, post haste, and we have our cinematographer coming in too. And so we're just gonna finalize the aesthetics of the space. So basically to bring out the background and the bottles here, what I'm doing is putting these little lights back here. And what that does, it just kinda pulls the bottles off the background. How's that looking, Blake? Um, that's getting a little washed out just because of that, but. Okay. Yes, these two seats are gonna be the focus area. Um, so, uh, Jamie, if I can just have you come out for a moment. So what this is, is atmosphere aerosol. We're just gonna spray some of this over here just to get a nice misty, uh, cinematic look to it. That should be good, right? How does it look? I kind of like it. Okay. All right, then we're good to go. What really stood out to me about this project is how things just kind of came together. I'm so happy that I get to work with the people that I do. It's an awesome crew, very talented, very dedicated, willing to put in that extra amount of effort. Cut. Good. Yeah, but not in this take. From what I remember, your jobs are loud and bloody. Do you think the old crew can handle it? Not alone. So I'm bringing some new blood. What do you say, Doc? One last job? Retired is retired. Not in this line of work, Doc. Not when you're still the best. Can you do that line one more time? Yep. Uh, we're gonna have to do this kind of whole thing one more time just because we need like a really fast version. Yeah, uh, just in case we have to trim fat. I know. Let's roll it. Action. What do you say, Doc? One last shot. That's totally shadow on my face, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yep. Yeah. All right, so here? Yeah. Here's fine. All right. Action. What do you say, Doc? One last job. Oh, to from the top? Yeah, let's just do it from the top. Fair play. Cool. And action. Retired is, retired does. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I've been waiting to say it. Uh... And, and that's the thing is sometimes you just gotta go out and do something more fun. Sometimes you don't have to get all deep into the minutia of things. Yeah, taking a simple idea, amplifying it through good craft. Going into any competition like this, you kind of have to decide very quickly, am I going to go back and try and find a script that would work for it and I can adapt, or am I going to try and write something from scratch? But uh, we opted to go for the first option. And by the end, I, I just, I, I thought that it was a, a neat thing and had like a lot of potential for this competition in particular, being the audience and the judges being people in the film industry uh, to make a film that is about film. 
and so I thought that it was interesting that being able to actually show the road mic in the video for the road mic competition. So Jamie was my teacher in high school and he played Doc on this project and he really gave me my first big opportunity to just make things, the equipment I needed to be able to make these projects. Dylan, David, who is audio on this project, Marguerite, we've all been working together for quite a while now. They're gonna see right through this. You know that, right? Anyway, I'm performing from the non-existent rap party at which I'm pretty sure I am the only one old enough to imbibe alcohol. But I wish everyone else in the competition good luck. This has been a blast. We'd really like to thank Showdown Motors, this establishment over here, for allowing us to use their space and uh, allowing us this awesome set piece, which uh, I think will take our film to the next level of cool. I'm, nev I'm not putting that in. I'm saying something else. <laughs> okay, I'm putting it in now. <laughs> So anyway, does that make me look good? You I... So. Get out of the job. Wait, I need to the lights that keep bouncing off on the engine on it. And this is what makes great behind the scenes. Okay, so we just wrapped on the last heist. It was a wonderful pleasure working with Blake Kleiner as the DP on this project. He made this look incredible. And it was also awesome working with my other co-director, Dylan. He really brought a great performance in this project and he, the script was great. I'm just very happy with how this all went. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching. My name is David and I have wrote this message. <laughs>